backwards, of course. So you have to you have to tune the tuner backwards to get it to come up. Yeah, it's like you use left-handed tuners or something. Good old Knutson. So this harp guitar is over a hundred years old, or approximately a hundred. Most likely. It's probably what a 1904. Not as easy to tune with these old tuners. You can tell it's got a pretty fat sound already. Those are done though. Okay, go ahead. Here's the, here's the first harp string there. Yeah, we were saying the. Uh, oh, dang it, dang it. This harp guitar has probably not had the harp strings strung on it for over a hundred years. So this is the first time. Boy, the spacing on those harp strings is just great, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, Knutson did some awfully weird things. There's two strings in one bridge pin hole right there, so you got two of the harp strings there. So it kind of works. Four holes, but five strings. Yeah, right. Five strings in, in the four holes. And then one of the guitar strings is on the other side of the saddle. You can see it. This is the low E of the guitar. The saddle, there's too, too wide a spacing down there, essentially. So there's quite a big gap on the low E string there, the guitar. Which should have probably been addressed with a new bridge, but we decided to keep this original. instrument in original condition. Hence the original tuners, the original bridge, the original neck see what it played like.
Nice guitar. Old guitar. Nice old guitar. Mm -hmm.